Is this blood? Are showing up? Yeah, there it is. Take a look, guys. Who is that? Somebody's there. What do you want? Wait. Is that the door? Gang, we have a massive, massive problem. As you all saw in my last few videos, I used this cursed demonic book to build a voodoo doll. And I thought it would be fun to use it on my brother just to see what kind of effects it would have on him. But what I didn't know is that we were in for a world of hurt. You see, in order for this specific voodoo doll to work, I had to use this demonic ritual, which ended up having massive side effects. For one, we were actually able to see scars appearing on my brother's body in real time. But even weirder than that, the person who was using the voodoo doll also had some strange side effects. But things got even worse when my friend Jester ended up using the voodoo doll on me without me even knowing. That was by far one of the craziest nights I think I have ever been through in my entire life. And I have a feeling that it is far from being over. We have to figure out exactly what the heck is going on with this voodoo doll and do a lot more research on this demonic book. Both of those items are still at the barn right now. So we are gonna wait until nightfall, get to the barn and try to get to the bottom of this entire situation. Okay, okay, okay. I don't see anybody. Hello? Anybody here? Okay, Grafting, I have to be extremely careful while I'm here because last time I was here, it was very evident that somebody else, besides me and Jesse, were here in this barn with us. Doll, and then get the heck out of here. What? Wait, let's get these lights all on. And now we're gonna grab the book and we're gonna do a little bit of investigating to see if we can figure out exactly what has happened last time we used that voodoo doll. Now, this is the book right here where we chanted a ritual that we actually had to translate using AI. And you can see the texts look terrifying and this is it. This is the text that we had to run through the translator to find the ritual in order to activate the voodoo doll. But there has been one thing that has been on my mind since the last video, and that is Jesse was able to read it without using any translator. And as you guys just saw, this is not English, not a single English word here. So how exactly was he able to read it? If you guys have any idea how he was able to do this, please leave it down in the comments section below. But for now, I think we have to call Jesse to see exactly what's going on. Okay, I'm calling Jesse right now and it's dialing. Hopefully we can get some answers from him. Hello? Jesse? Hey, what's up, man? Okay, yeah, um, I have some questions about the book and the whole like voodoo doll situation that happened a couple days ago. Pretty much, I was wondering how you were able to read it. What do you mean? Well, I mean, you chanted the ritual and everything and Looking at it right now, it's it's not in English whatsoever. I don't understand how you're able to, you know. Perfect English. Like, have you are you are you absolutely sure? Because I had to use a bunch of like AI translators to get a rough translation of this thing, and it took hours to do it, and you just were able to read it. Yeah, I mean, we mean it. It was literally in English. I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah. Okay. Well. If he was able to read it, maybe he would have gotten a more direct translation and there might've been something that we missed. So let's ask him about that. Um, Jesse, is there anything that you could tell us about the book? Like what exactly did it say? The only I remember is, uh, whoever does the ritual yeah. is possessed by uh, the, the god of torture. Yeah, that's right. A god of torture. Who, wait, you're saying whoever... Okay, sorry, the, the lights in the, the barn were just flickering. That's I'm getting really creeped out over here. Is there is anything else that you could tell me about, like, God of Torture or, like... Yes, that's right. I was going to tell you to be very careful. There's Okay. Call just dropped. One sec. I'm, I'm going to call him back. The number you dialed is not in service. 
call, not in service. Okay. Okay, this whole thing isn't making any sense. When I use the translator to translate this book, Jesse just told me that whoever chants the ritual gets possessed by some god of torture. But when I use the translator, it told me that the person bonded with the voodoo doll is the one that gets possessed. Something is not making sense here at all, and I need to- Whoa! Wait! The lights completely went out! Hello? Who's there? Oh, Jesus. Okay, there's definitely something in that corner right there. Hello? Whoever's there, this isn't funny, okay? Okay. Hey, Jesus. It seems like it's getting louder and way more aggressive. Hello? Okay, I'm I'm coming around the corner and uh, you're not going to like what's going to happen next. Okay. Wait. Hello? What the? Is this... Blood? Whoa! Oh my god! The doll! What the hell? Happened to this thing? It looks like somebody was beating it against this locker! Ow! Ow! My head! Ah! 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 What the heck is going on? Oh, my head. Oh, why did it just feel so dizzy? Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Oh. Graph gang, something very strange is happening. I just got this pounding, pounding headache and then uh, I dropped the doll and then I felt like I was falling. Is this doll linked to me right now? That doesn't make any sense. How could the doll possibly be linked to me if there was no ritual done? Every other time, there had to be some sort of ritual and suddenly, I felt the intense pain after it was banging on the wall and then I felt like falling after I dropped it. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the table and run some tests on the doll to see if I'm actually linked to it. Graph Gang, I need your support more than ever. Don't forget to smash that like button if you're enjoying this video so far. With all that being said, let's just get this over with. All right, Nick, deep breath. Okay, three, two, one, and ah, there we go. We just cut the right eye of this voodoo doll, and now we're gonna wait to see if, ah, yeah, okay, I'm feeling some pain in my eye, and there it is, the cut appearing on my face. Ah, it for sure stings a lot, a lot, a lot, and then there it goes as the pain slowly fades away. Somehow I am linked to this voodoo doll. There's no me being possessed through holding the doll. There's nothing else strange that is happening. So I'm not really sure about what the rules to this doll and this ritual are, but I think it's a good idea to try just a few more tests. Now because a little slash wasn't that painful, we're gonna do it one more time, just across the chest right there and we're gonna wait to see exactly what happens and immediately I could start feeling pain and it should start showing up yeah there it is take a look guys there is a cut from my chest coming up my neck oh my god and it's gone it disappears pretty fast which is obviously hello Who's there? What the hell? Who's there? Hello? Graf Gang, I swear we heard that laughing, right? Hello? Oh, Jesus. Somebody out there? Hello? Okay. Alright. I think I'm a little crazy here. Um, we're gonna grab the doll, we're gonna grab the book, we're gonna pack it up, and we're gonna bring it back to my place and uh, I don't know, do some more research or, or something because we need to figure out what's going on. But this barn is for sure not safe, so let's just go in here, close this up, lock it, and let's grab this stuff. Oh, wait, who is that? Somebody's there. 
What do you want? Wait. Is that the doll? Ah! Oh! Ah! Ah! Oh! Jesus! Ah! Oh! Jesus! Okay. Somebody has the doll and is actually attacking me with it. Okay. I need to figure this out and get the hell out of here right now. Hello? What the heck do you want, huh? What do you want from me? Just... Oh. 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 